Hello, baby gangsters, this is Calvin, also known as Rummer, and this is my first ever playthrough of Genshin Impact. Look at this little, like, team we have here now. G oh, God, it's... Oh, no, don't go into the water! No! Oh, he's climbing. He's climbing by himself. Well, okay, okay, one second. I'll get the... Wait, one second. Someone stop him! Someone stop... No! Don't do it! Don't do it! Don't do it! Don't do it! Where are we going? Where are we going? Where are we going? Okay, okay, one second. Okay, okay. Um... <laughs> Just in time. Okay, great. Um... <laughs> I didn't know if that the controller disconnects. Um, it like, does that? Like it just makes whatever your last input, it just keeps going? Uh, well anyway, let's start this again. Hold on a second guys, one second. Hello baby guys. <laughs> um, okay, uh, I don't think Jean's a, Jean's a mainstay yet just because like, I want, I know for a fact that I want fish ability because I used her before and her design is so freaking cool. Uh, love this character. We finally have a spear user on our team and I'm very, very happy. Uh, it's, it's, it's been a while. And we finally have a spear user on our team. And with Jean, um, it's another sword user, but like I, I feel like I'd want to like practice her moves somewhere. So I wonder if going to like the first area and practicing her moves might be the good idea, like just in between the commissions. Um, yeah, just because like I, we, we still don't have like a, a full idea of how we want to. Do it. So what, what I mean by going to the early areas of the first area, I mean like going right like to Starfall Lake. But I think the, the enemies might have leveled up by the time since we've been there. But we can still use, um... Is there enemies here? I don't think there's even enemies here at Starfall Lake. But, like, we can head towards here and see if there any hilly trails around here. Jean's a really, uh, cool character. I had no idea I could get her. It was kind of funny because, like... Uh, you know, I, I was, like, uh, talking to, like, my, um... Some of my patrons and I was like... You know, I got, an, I got an under five star. They're like, oh, don't tell us who it is. And I was like, I don't want to tell you who it is. And then I was like... They like guessed it in one, so I had to like act like I didn't. <laughs> I was like, I was like, it's a gene, and I was like, uh, you can get gene, because <laughs> I'm not like I'm not good at like you know containing um excitement like that. Level twenty, okay, that'll do. I know it's not a good indication yeah. of like was well, because especially since the weapons. So that's like actually a really cool move, that thrust. Okay, hold on a second, that thrust is really good, and I know that like. Animo won't work well with, um, like, Dendro, because Dendro works with fire, electric, and, and water, right? Um, so you're talking about, like, I just want to try this move out as well, though. Man, it just shoots at nearby enemies as well? Not as not as arching, but we still want to we still want to try out Jean's moves. We still want to try out Jean's moves. Um, yeah, the thrust is really good. Like that thrust is a really fun move. I, I could see I myself using that, but like I, I don't I don't feel the need. I never have since the start of this. Jean, how did you put out a fire with your legs? Well done. Um, I don't really see. Yeah, we're gonna get. Obviously, trashed by a few of these enemies. Because again, we're, low, we're lower level, so it's not like a really an accurate depiction of what she can do. But like, I just want to see maybe her special move, maybe. But that's really cool, like a swirl. Oh, yeah, I think I think we can. I think we can put Jean on the team. I think that's I think that's a good compromise if we don't get Zhao. You know what I mean? But I think I want to hold off adding like leveling up Jean just in case we do get Zhao, because Zhao was still like the most fun character I've ever gotten to play as. So I think I would definitely like to see if we can get like, because we already like we have Sayu if we need, and uh, and even oh, this one. Here we go. Is this healing as well? And that's a really freaking good move though. But yeah, I think today we'll just add a different character to, to this little party. I want to try out this party anyway. But basically, what I'm gonna do is. Have uh, maybe Kaya stand in to see if it would be a good idea to have someone like Zhao on the team. Uh, we are still a ways away from getting Zhao. Um, I would very much like Zhao. <laughs> I would very much like Zhao, but I don't know if it's going to happen. How many days does that say is left? It's 11 days. So we have just enough time, I think. No, we have we have four play sessions to get Zhao. That's what we have. Um, fair enough. That's what we have. We have four play sessions to get Zhao. So I think we might save up to see if we can get 1600 gems. I don't think it could happen. 
I don't think either they, they've have they replenished the gems in the shop yet. We're gonna do our commissions, by the way, very soon. They have. So how many can, can we buy? Five. Wait, if we buy five of these and then use. I'm kind of on board for using these, because, like, what, like, is it, do they want me to buy these characters? Is that why you guys, like, don't want me to use these? I think someone was saying that, like, it's, it's, there's two schools of thought, and these are harder to get. Um, so I totally get that. Um, I totally understand that. So let's just do, let's just, let's just do everything normally for now. Um, and then figure everything out after that. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go to our commissions. And then we're going to be doing the acorn quest today, which I'm actually kind of excited for. These look like the same um, commissions that we did last time. Or at least one of the times. Also, change our party. Actually, you know what? Let's put it... Let's... let's you know what we could... I still... Hmm. Um... Let's see. What could we... Um, we could... I think putting Gom in there. I think that was the original plan. And I think we put Gom in there for now. So we can get Is a little more acquainted with Gom. And then we can rename this team for now. And we'll call them... Um, fashion... Eastas. Is that how you spell it? Fashion Eastas. Because I think they are the best designed outfits across all the game. And now we have Gaman. Which I think is actually like a really good team. I know Fischl is like actually very like common. And it's not like I'm like, I have this rare character. But it's not about being rare. It's not about being meta. It's never been about that. But to me it's always... Oh, who's throwing... Wait, what? Which enemy? A dendro enemy? Which who is this? Hello? Oh, hello. So let's try this out. So we have this bunny move, which is actually like, I think, kind of neat. And then Fischl. We haven't been able to try out her move yet. Oh, mama. With the bow as well? See, it's not as efficient as, as Nahida. Not as efficient as Nahida, but... I think it's fun to change up your playstyle every once in a while. And the great thing about it is, like, not one person has asked me to do that. Like, like the, the, I'm not trying... I hope it doesn't make it seem like someone's like, Calvin, you're using the Yida too much. Never. No, never. People are very, very nice. Um, it, it's literally just, like, me, like, every once in a while wanting to change up the style. Light a fire first. No, I want to... Oh, sorry. Where do you want this stuff delivered to, boss? Why would they? Ch I don't. I, I don't get that at all. There we go. Did we light a fire? Okay, let's try and light a fire. No, it's way harder to light a fire with Gobbit, apparently. <laughs> there we go. We lit a fire. Um. So let's auto cook a bunch of these, I guess. Sixteen. Heck yeah. That'll do me. Thank you. Okay, let's do our commissions, and we're gonna do the Aircon quest. Like, it's it's so strange because like this game is so full of stuff to do that we haven't done like a main Aircon quest since the Venti quest, right? Like the Venti quest was like the last time we did an Aircon quest of any kind. Strange, right? Like it feels like it feels like we've done a lot. I guess the like, story quests are very, very meaty as well, and we have done quite a few story quests. Don't be scared, Don't be scared she says. Oh my god, that's actually really good, guys. That's actually really good. I like that. Oh my god, why, like, again, not, like, perfect, but I'm actually on board for it, you know what I mean? Still breathing. <laughs> I'm so on board for this. 
We might not even need G. But then again, it seems kind of weird not to like... Well, no, here's the thing. We don't have to use five stars just because we get them. Um, what gives? And this is a healing move as well? If you're... Oh my god, that's actually really good. That's really good. Don't take this. Let me read you a verse. Your really good characters. Some really good characters here. By royal decree. And that le I feel like that electro charge move is really good because you can focus on like that to still doing electro charge moves while like doing other stuff. I actually like that. That's really good. Next one we're going to is over here, which we don't have to fast travel this to th this one because it's in the same kind of vicinity. In terms of protagonist, like like we could, we're gonna call them the protagonists because they are like all to me like they could all be potentially main characters. But then again, I look at Fischl and she looks looks like the, the side character who like like I said is trying to bite you at every moment. Um, <laughs> and then you look at like someone like um, Garmin is like a Yu-Gi-Oh protagonist. Yao Yao, just an amazing uh, looking character as well. I love the design as well. I love the little jacket. Fashion is so important to me in games. Like, it really is. Um, and I've talked about it a million times to the point that it's, like, nauseating probably for people to be like... They're probably like, Calvin, like, we get it. <laughs> fashion, you love fashion. And it's like, yeah, I, I, I love it because, like... So much about how you... Oh, that was very short. Is it, if you get hit, does it stop? How... Can I get bubbled and that at the same time? I'm trying to get rid of the smaller guys before we do anything. Which probably wasn't the best idea in the world. What are you, water? What are you, a water guy? We're getting frozen every second. And I genuinely think it's also because he's... Okay. You're about to learn the meaning of the word pain. Yeah, this team isn't perfect, but like I guess we're going to get better with them as time goes on. And um like to me it's like it's like every every time when I've been like oh, I I I think fashion is so important in video games you ha you do get people being like that's very superficial and like I totally get uh that it's superficial that it like that like the idea of clothing is like it's it's not in real life you know I would never be like oh that person's wearing this actually no you might be like oh that person's wearing this that's kind of cute but like in a video game like you have to look at these characters for like 60 hours in some cases. I want my character to like look the way I would like love to dress them. You know what I mean? Like this is an awesome outfit. This is a really cool outfit. This looks freaking awesome. This looks awesome to me. You know? And I think that's fair. Like you can and also you can appreciate a good character even if they're poorly dressed, right? But I like fashion in games. Okay? <laughs> no one's no one argue with me. Okay? Calvin, literally no one has said anything to you. you. You sure? Wait, there's like... You know, I'm not intentionally, by the way, not being able to get these little um, geo crystal things. But legit, like, I've seen them on the map a bunch of times, and then I look up in the sky or look down, and they're nowhere to be seen. Like, and some of them, I can't even get. Tea, wine, I get it. The running animations in this game are really good too, because they like really put take into account like like the size of the character, like how they would like sway with the with the wind going against them. Like I really feel like they did a good job with that. Oh, is this another stair guy? Oh, there's one right there. Cool. Uh, I know as well, like that. Um. I was very lucky. I'm very lucky when it comes to pulls, so I should be happy that I got we got another five star. Oh, it's just one thing after the other. Still repairing the staircase? Oh, you've come at just the right time. Thanks again for last time. Now it's time for round two. This is one is a little bigger. I don't have enough wooden planks for it. I sent one of the porters to fetch a new batch, however. He was attacked by monsters on the way back. He panicked and fled back, abandoning the wood planks on the way. 
It gave him a real fright. I managed to get him to the point where uh, out where the wooden planks are, but I simply could not uh, talk to him into uh, into going back there to collect them. I've racked my brains for a solution, but in the end, you're the only one I can help. Would you mind fetching some wooden planks for me? Okay. Perfect. I'll wait here for you. Did you have a a different voice from yesterday? Who knows? You're the one who does the voices, Calvin. It's not it's not me. You decide the voices. We should also do that event with the um the hilly churns, and then we'll do the acorn quest. I think that's probably the best idea. Um, yeah, because like I you don't want to you know I feel like I'm missing out on an event that is like that is probably very silly, especially when it takes like two minutes. Okay, if we sneak in, who's the sneakiest out of all of us? Oh God, we can't sneak in. Start with that. Wings of darkness, come sever night from day. Do we have to hold it? I wonder. No rest for the wicked. I feel like it was way longer when I was doing it in the the trial. <laughs> I feel like it was way longer. Rain outlines your fate. Don't be scared. Don't be scared. To me, if a character ever says, "Don't be scared." That is cute to be terrified. Let me weave you first. Am I wrong? <laughs> He's a really good fun sword user. And in fairness, like she's a really fun spear user as well. Like, look at that. That's really fun as well. There we go. We got our five wooden planks. And I seen the comments on the previous video um, kind of helping me out with how to do the um, other side quests. We will get around to those next week then. I think that's what we'll do. Like the, the, the plate stuff and things like that. So I thank you for that. Uh, where are you, buddy? Where are you? Oh, it has to be on top of the thing here, doesn't it? The, the other... Um, the other geocrystal. You know, and everyone's, everyone, like, you know, I understand everyone's definitely looking out, you know, for me and this stuff, and they want me to have the best experience possible. Uh, you know, people worry that I'm going to get burnt out. Like, I'll just say to you right now, like, I'm playing this three times a week. Um, literally only three times a week for two hours at a time, maybe. Sometimes a little bit longer uh, on occasion. Uh, I can tell you that, like, it's it, it, there's a very low chance of me getting burnt out when every single week... The excitement level is always high. When I finish playing this game on Friday, and I don't play it again until next Thursday, next Wednesday, there is a feeling of like, man, I cannot wait to get back into this. And like, here's the thing, I have been thinking about it for a bit, of adding an extra like, shorter episode maybe during the week. Maybe adding a Friday episode. Um, adding another hour to the, to, to the, like an hour long episode where like, maybe we do, like call, I wanted to call it like some like side quest city where we like, do a bunch of side quests. Um, but we'll see how that works out. I don't want to promise anything because then, like, you know, that always leads to, um, bad feelings. Where is he? Where is your boy? He's over there. Hello! I got your wooden planks! Have you brought the wooden planks? Here they are. Wonderful, finally. Gosh, these monsters are no end of trouble. These should be plenty. Many thanks. I will get started straight away. It's alright. Finished. Finally, it's repaired. What do you think, YDY? It looks alright, huh? Uh, with any luck, it might actually be uh, fit for, t uh, for purpose, too. <laughs> anyway, thanks for your trouble. Many thanks once again. Please just stop by for a cup of tea or a bite to eat, whatever you want. This chef we've got really is rather good. Yeah, we're not gonna wish. Uh, you know, we have like a bunch of pri a bunch of gems. We're close to getting another wish. I think we're gonna wait until the last second and then do a nice little final wish. Um, there's one more commission left, and it's over here. I think that's the best option. I'm actually into that idea. Are you into that idea? I'm putting the microphone to you guys. Are you into that idea? What do you guys think? Oh yeah, wasn't this one an easier one to get? Yeah. Microphone to your face. What do you think? 
You know, really, I thought that uh, this uh, whole thing was going really well, and then Calvin decided to uh, not do the Archon quest right away. Okay, okay, put the microphone away from there. What do you think? You know, really, um, you my are. opinion yeah. is, is that uh, Twix bars, the left one is always better than the right one. <laughs> Look at that. That's actually a really cool move, though, isn't it? That's actually a really cool official. Get it. Are you still alive? Where is she? Girl? As we need to talk. Wish, me, <laughs> oh, look at me. Just... Oh, it's my bird. <laughs> I was like, get out of here. Get out of here, bird. Do you need fire for this? To overload it, I guess? I think I've already made a mistake by coming here. Oh. Guys. Yeah, we're fighting enemies because we need all the practice in the world, my friends. For a new team. When we have a new team, you need more practice. When you have an old team, less practice. When you have Nahida, no practice. <laughs> When you when you have Nahida and yeah oh Nahida and you have Bennett no practice at all. I did that. Oh, it's a time challenge. Lovely. Actually, the, the challenges in this game are actually super fun. Maybe it's the same time challenge as before, the one we always do every single episode now. But then again, they probably are waiting for me to discover more things in the world before they can, like, really give me the full rundown. Um, wait, so would her bunny work with this then? Because people are saying that, like, I think some of the, these stuff kind of works sometimes. Let's see, if I put that there. Oh, no, it's just a regular pillar. Okay, let's go. Add a bit, just a tiny bit extra time to it. That's all we need to do. Oh, there's some of the flowers that we want, right? Rain outlines your face. Is it? I think the flaming flowers are one. Yeah, they're, 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 that's what we needed for your man. Um... We need to see that's the thing. A lot of my other enemies were like our characters, like you didn't need to get as close, but we have to realize we have to get a little bit closer. So there's probably more fire flowers in this area then. Official, get official. Um, by the way, I saw you know people, you know, very nicely still pointing out the flowers that we need. We're not gonna be ascending. Uh, is it Xinyang? We're not going to be sending her, I'm sorry. Uh, it's, um, we're not looking for those flowers. Like, I haven't actively been looking for those flowers in about 10 years. I'll be honest with you guys. I thank you for still helping, though. It's very kind. Um, maybe if we go up here, we can find those flowers then for that guy who was like, hey, give me the flowers or die. Remember, he's like, you need to give me those flowers or else we're in trouble. Or else I will hurt you. It was very weird. Very weird request. What is that? Oh, this is just that weird psycho forest. The crazy one. Whoa, man. Oh, yes, this area. Can we do this one? I'm not going to do it right now, but I just want to see if we can do it. Hmm. 
No, not yet. Okay, level 59. I don't think level 59 exists. I think 40 is the cap. Okay, so then we have the little, uh, what you call it? Where was that event thing on? Here? Oh, we should do this anyway, because we're so close to getting, um, yeah, let's claim, yeah, new BP, uh, claim these as well, um, then we can claim these, okay, wait, we got these, oh, okay, uh, claim rewards, cool, okay, some Mora, um, Okay, then we have... There has to be other... No, this is the wrong one. It's... It's it's in here, I think. Maybe not. Connor's Brew. Story quest. So, have we... Oh, we have another key! Claim! We can do another story quest. But with who? So, we got... We got Bennett's... Two out of uh, six Bennett endings. Uh... We still can't do Sayus. We can do Diana. We can do uh, Barbara's. But we, don't know, we need two of these. We only have one. Um, so we need one more. Okay, then, that's fine. And I think we'll do Barbara next. Barbara! You are Barbara. Commissions. Hold on a second here. Where would where where did, where did we find the 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 thing last time? The event. I know it, like you go maybe into the, the the special event tab, but I don't think it, it was there. I think it was like in this. Yes. Event details. Because now we can do unlocks in fifteen hours, so we have to still wait. Okay, that's fine. So they meant like a, like, like two, okay, that's fine. 15 hours, 15 hours, 15 hours. We can do it next week then, if it's still on. So now, friends, let us go do the acorn quest. It's been a while, right of dissension, talk to the locals. So that's the mission right there. And we don't even have any fast travel, we'll have to walk there. No, we'll go this way. Oh, we also have to collect our daily commissions, so that's, that's, <laughs> that's important too, to get those little gems. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, I say. Hello. Astra Abyssoft. Thank you for completing to- I mean, it's nice, I'll take it. And we're almost adventure rank 30, man. Okay, let's go and talk to the locals. Um, let's do like half cannon. Let's, yeah. <laughs> Those guys walking around here like they're the protagonists. We are the protagonists. Look at our characters. Look at the way you dress and look at the way we dress. Protagonists for life. Protagonists for life. Body and mind. Body and mind. Hello. Oh, are you also foreigners here for the Rite of Dissension? <sighs> to think I've lived in Liyue all these years and never come to see this before. That happens, man. There's so many events in your own hometown you never see until you, like, make the effort. <laughs> I guess it's like they say. Locals never visit the tourist spots. Ah, I wish you well on your travels. Liyue always welcomes you. I think it, the, 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 definitely the pronunciation changes depending on the voice actor. <laughs> Which is fair enough. Uh, Liyue? And then Liyue. You too Liyue. wish to bear witness to the right of dissension? <laughs> Me too. We all do. What's funny is this is probably the exact voice I would have given this guy. As a businessman myself, how could I not take interest in Liyue's most important business trends? The 17 predictions given last year made more than a few ripples throughout the industry. Mm. What's more, 
There has been a rumor going around that the Tian Shui herself, Ning Guang, has been acting secretly in the shadows. Oh, for real? She wants the rocks created by GeoVision holders to be exempt from taxation. Wow, that's some super professional legal stuff, that is. <laughs> to be on the pulse of the predictions and the market is what makes this harbor what it is. It is. It does seem very like a like a savvy kind of like Among place for seven, trading. Rex Lapis is the oldest deity. His keen sense of strategy is well trusted among his people. Understanding the predictions as soon as possible can make all the difference in making your fortune. Right. So there's another local being talked to. Gentry Dean. Right of dissension. Oh yeah, that reminds me. Great Isn't voice acting. Today? Great voice acting. Let's go. Once a year, Rex Lapis bestows upon us his divine prediction, guiding us on how to run Liu for the coming year. Last year, it was the Yuhang of the Liu Qixing that was given the honor of asking for the divine prediction. Liu Qixing? Uh, Ooh, Paimon knows this one. Mon's dad is to freedom as Liu is to contracts. Liu has a strong focus on business and trade. The Liu Qixing, the seven leaders of the seven enterprises of Liu, hold true control over Liu. Seven leaders. So, like, it's again. It is a very business-focused place, That's I guess. What foreigners always say. Outlanders versus foreigners. What's the, I wonder what the is that just a translation thing? But true control over Liu will always be held by Rex Lapis. Prove it. The Qixing is comprised of mere mortals. Rex Lapis is a god. Monstat's god is nowhere to be seen, whilst our god is forever with us. You should see Venti, man. He was everywhere with us. Stay in Liu long enough, and you'll see. Venti's a good boy. Given that you just left your godless city, Jesus. it's time you experienced what it's like to be in a city whose god has walked with it through all of history. That is the lore, though. The lore is, and I guess other cities would see it like that. Your god left. <laughs> your god is god. Great! Then we can start our experience off with the rite of dissension. Good choice. Then get going. To the high ground. So let's see. Okay, so we just have to go up. Man, this is kind of cool. Like, again, um, it, it does have a quest marker on it, but I always bring up the idea of Shenmue to uh, when I'm talking about, like, like stuff like this. Shenmue's quests are literally, like, they're not quests. They're literally like, hey, go talk to this person. You know? Go to, you know, find out where, what, how, who was in the black car. And you have to literally just talk to people around the town. There's no, like thing that you automatically go like like you know like when characters will talk to each other in a video game and they'll be like huh without getting any information beforehand if it's a black car we ought to go to the the harbor they always have black cars down there and it's like it's much more interesting to have like a local person be like yeah i saw that black car that was saturday when that black car was around the guy who got out of the car he was massive he was gigantic it was kind of crazy and you're like, oh, I'll, go, I'll do that then. I'll go find a big, massive guy with uh, that in, in, in a black car. And it's like, that's so, like, much better than... I see a main character there. Oh, no, maybe it did. Bit of popping. Um, yeah, that's, to me, that's always, like, better than just, like, characters isolated. Because sometimes, like, I think games do like to isolate their characters quite a bit. And then, like... And then the townspeople feel like nothing. You know, the townspeople in your town feel like nothing then. Whereas, like, in Mondstadt, I can go around and, like, I know everyone's I'm name dead. now. You know what I mean? And I don't know as much as Li Liyue, because I feel like I don't, haven't really spent as much time in Liyue doing quests as I did in Mondstadt yet. Um, but, like, it's, 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 like, like, to me, it's, like, is it really realistic if, like, I'm playing your big game and then a character... Like shows up out of nowhere and looks so and has like it's so distinctive. Oh, it's the character with the beard and the big belly. I wonder if he's gonna die after you introduce him. <laughs> you know? Paimon heard that the best time to make a wish is today, during the rite of dissension. Wanna give it a try? Sure. This is what I was talking about. Look at this. Halt. Those not involved in the proceedings are not permitted to go any further. 
I saw her in the in the in the trials. I just wanted to talk. Wait, we have her, don't we? Do we not get her? Did we got her as a character? Wait, hold on a second. I forgot about that. Did we get her as a character? Did Jean overshadow the fact that? Did we get her? Am I wrong? I might be wrong. Did I like think I got her as a character? Hold on a second. Let me see. We d we did we did. Should we use her instead? Maybe because people are like she's really good. But I don't know. Like I I, I did, no no we're not using because I didn't have fun with her. I remember her now. I didn't have fun with her when we we were um, playing the game. Yeah, there we go. Jean definitely overshadowed anything we got last episode. I think apart from official. Oh, you also want a little adept eye luck too? Sure. <laughs> Seems you know a lot. Making a wish during this time is sure to get you the blessings of both the Adepti and Rexalapis himself. I've already made my wish, so you can take this. Great! Thanks! Paimon always sounds sarcastic even though I know she's being super genuine. I wish I could find my sister soon. We forget that we're searching for our sister. This is like, this is like, look, when, when like Link goes, like is looking for Zelda and he goes off and does three million things. And we're just like, well, I guess we are like trying our best to get more powerful so we can find our sister. That's the way we should um contextualize it. We're trying to get more powerful so we can find our sister. Uh, I wonder where our sister is. You got. You guys said that she was a part of the the abyss order, but like I genuinely think that like you guys are just playing a prank. I I, not, I don't mean to step on it. Your first time in Liga? Actually, it's my first time to see the Rite of Dissension too. Cool. Ah, oh, look, that's Miss Ningguang of the Liu Shishin. Ningguang. Only Liu those Xing. who have control in Liu can preside over the Rite of Dissension. People change the name of it's Liu Wei, Liu Wei, Liu. Oh yeah, not sure if you knew, but most of the Adepti appear in the form of various beasts. I heard that when attending these kinds of formal occasions, Rex Lapis himself appears as a celestial cross between two of Liu's ancient mythical creatures. Ah, sorry, I shouldn't interrupt your wish. Please, take this. One of my favorite things is where the light changes as the sun is going down or up or whatever in this game. I wish you get some leads on the Geo Archon. Guess we can just wait here for things to get started. Hmm. Who knows how long that Miss Ning Wong lady is gonna take? I mean, we can join the crowd and wait for the right ascension to begin. I think that's a good, really nice little quest. Just hang out here and watch her do it. You and Paimon wait for the right of ascension to begin. I'm actually excited for this. Oh, the cutscenes look so good. The animations are so good. I'll climb on your shoulders. Like, look at that. Look at the animations. Okay. Oh, my God. Beautiful. Beautiful design. Beautiful design. The hour is upon us. I just, yeah, seeing this for the first time would be insane. Wait, this isn't good? Oh no, it's another dragon. Gee. Okay, so this was not supposed to happen. Man, this isn't the time for like gossip, man. I'd be like, what the hell? <laughs> What? <laughs> what? Seal the exit, girl. That was from the sky. You're gonna have to put a tarp. What? What? What's going on? They killed the god of this area. Did she just say Rex Lapis is the Geo Archon? Is what? Oh no, the Millilith. Looks like they're nabbing suspects who got too close. Paimon's freaking out! The killer is amongst us! 
Wait, but how? How would you kill a Wait. god like that? We got close. Are we suspects? We also have the Geo Archon as a part of us. Wait, where are you going? If it was God we faced off against when we first arrived in this world too, we can't fall into their hands. Let's go with that. I feel like our character wouldn't say, Oh god, we have to get out of here without being oh, spotted? There's a whole bunch of soldiers out there too. Your identity. You may not be the killer, but we can't let them get you. But can we even get out of here safely? Oh my god. No, you didn't see me. I'm over here. You didn't see me. Oh my god. <laughs> this is so cool. It's not cool that a, a Rex Lab has just died. It's terrifying. That... A reward on the road. Okay, is there any people down there? Hold on a second. Man. So we took this we took a way out here, right? We took a way out here. I like that you still play as Wander, by the way. Freaking awesome. Yeah, that that put, puts my mind. <laughs> Bro, we just we didn't do anything. Now we look like we did something. Oh, look, all the animations are so good. There's nowhere to run. Hey, buddy, hold still. Who are you? Oh, it's a wa a water character at least. Dude, wait. Come with me. Do you think that we would have been? I think I think I think because like of like who we are, we would have been probably like, we would have been arrested. I think we would have been right away. That's so cool. The cutscenes in this game are so good. Just almost as magic flowing. So insensitive. Yeah, someone just helps. Oh, an earring. Just who are you exactly? Call me child. Okay, child. Child? What? So we're supposed to dote on you? Paimon just gets saved by someone, and this is how cheeky she is, right? She gets saved by someone, and she goes, I'm gonna frickin' take the piss out of this guy. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, not at all. It's an alias of sorts. In Mondstadt... I don't suppose you came across a Senora by any chance. We did. She effed us up. Senora? Child? <gasps> You're Fatui, one of the Harbingers. Wait, what? Oh, no. Don't worry. I'm not looking for Wait, a Wait, he's fight. Fatui. Senora gave you quite the bad impression, huh? <sighs> that woman. Can't say I'm a fan either. We just got saved by a Fatui member. And he doesn't smell. But seriously, though, that's insane. Like, we're getting a whole different impression of someone else from the Fatui here. We should have guessed, I guess, from like the little right. mask on his side. Let's but forget all about her, shall we? I'm here to help you. Okay, so here's the thing, right? I don't need help from the Fatui. Would be such like a good answer, right? Go leave? No, 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 no. That's not a wonder style. Help? I think that right now we're shook up. We just saw a god die. We've been chased by the police, and now we've been saved by a Fatui member. I don't think we we we. I don't think I would be in the right mind to be able to say, oh, th these cool things. I'm saying help. Yes, help. You know what I mean? That's my mindset I'm on this. I'm not a bad guy. Oh, okay, perhaps I'm kind of a bad guy, but I'm not here to give you any trouble. I'm not. I'm not a bad guy. I'm just a bad man. Would it be too much to ask for you to keep the sword sheathed? We'll do it for now. I thank you for your knightly nobility. And it is totally understandable that, like, Wander and Paimon would be ready to fight a member of the Fatui when the last member we just saw of the Fatui, like, in terms of, like, major members, tried to kill Venti, you know, right in front of us, and then tried to kill us. I heard of your deeds in Mondstadt, so I couldn't help but notice you during the proceedings back there. And because I had my eye on you the whole time, I know it wasn't you. Someone else was clearly behind it. But, regrettably, given I'm a Fatui envoy from Snezhnaya, there's no way I'd be trusted after something of this magnitude. The ruling Chi Sing of Liyue has always been overly suspicious of us. Well, can you honestly blame them? 
<laughs> yeah. Guess no, I shouldn't try 100%, to deny that. One hundred percent. One hundred and ten percent. Okay, sure. Maintaining a distance between strangers is probably a good idea. Either way, I'm already used to it. At, at least he's point. at least he's fully aware of the the issues that that will face him. But right now, if you want to clear yourselves of any suspicion, you need to get yourselves to Northland Bank. Why is he helping Staying us? Staying here isn't an option. As the old I guess it's to improve his maybe his standing. The walls have ears. The walls have ears. Like I get, I get him as a character, and I get what you're saying. But at the same time, it's like, man, you're putting your neck out for us. Like, but I guess like he probably doesn't care. Like, Fatui members don't care that much. I'd say. That's what I'm guessing, right? Like, it's not that they don't care, but there probably is an element of like, you know, we're already not liked. We're already disliked by a lot of people. So we might, I might as well just do what I like or do what I hope for. I will say though. Unexpected to have a Fatui member save us. Really cool writing, because now I'm already questioning my dislike of the Fatui, because now it's like, wait. It says higher, but it says lower there, look. I'm already questioning my dislike of the... Maybe it's here. I'm already questioning now, like, oh, I, I dislike the Fatui, but this guy was actually very nice to us. So should, wait, what are you, what is happening? Bro? Here? You know what, let's, 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 let's not leave any doubt. Oh. What should I put in my letter? This is so weird, like having talking to a Fatui member like this. We need a protagonist, let's go. They're all protagonists. Northland Bank. This is this is feels so weird. It feels like 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 I don't know, like you know like what it feels like is you ever like to have someone who know you know they don't like you and you don't like them? But, like, you have to stand together for a bit because, like, the other group, friends in the group are, like, um, like, doing something else. Like, the other friends in the group are like, oh, we're back in two seconds, let's go into the shop. And, like, you just have to sit there with the other person and you're like, yeah, so, um, you still doing that, uh, painting thing? It's like, ah, I stopped painting two years ago. Oh, okay. You still play the guitar? Uh, no, no, not really. They've been gone a while, haven't they? Yeah, I suppose. Correct. That kind of way, that's what it feels like. Here in Liwa by Snezhnaya. Though everyone knows but he seems Liwa very reasonable. The most enterprising in Tevat, Snezhnaya is not short of change either. Yeah, well, poorer nations don't seem the type to have diplomats that come around acting the way yours do towards the Knights of Favonius. I love that Paimon is still taking him to task, by the way. It's so good. <laughs> here, let me give you this. He's too tall to be on our team, by the way. Too tall. This is a... I'm not sure exactly. Sometimes all money can buy is things, and not a name for oneself. All I know is that it's a sigil. A sigil to keep the mighty and illuminated Adepti from bringing harm to you. Adepti? If you head north from the harbor, then west from Gwaili Plains, you will eventually reach a stone forest known as Dweyun Karst. If you head north from the, to the harbor, to the west of Julie Plains, you'll eventually reach a stone forest. And was, okay, have you been there before, Lira I wonder? Believe it to be the abode of the Adepti. Isn't it just a legend? Legend or not, they believe it. As such, offerings to the Adepti are made at its borders. Nobody dares venture in. But I have no need for believing. Not when I know for a fact that the Adepti truly exist. He's such a different vibe from every Fatui member we've met so it, far. But your Fatui intel seems all right. But why would we go looking for a Depti anyway? <laughs> oh, my little friend. Little there friend. Are plenty of reasons mortals seek the blessings of a Depti: money, health, love. But you, you will go for justice. Justice? The Chi Sing will already have dispatched the Millilith. They'll be seeking out the assassin from amongst the onlookers. But how could a mere mortal kill a god that can sweep aside entire armies? Rex Lapis never gave up his power as a god. 
This level of crude response is beyond what is called for. How you think you're trying to? You think you're trying to hide the the true culprit? Wait, oh, that's actually like a really good point, isn't it? Why would they be so aggressive, like, to chase me right away? I suppose that, yeah, if you look at it from that perspective, maybe they are just trying to pin it on someone as quick as possible. Because they went into action right away. And sealing off the exits? What do you mean? Like, it was from the sky. Or to hide something else. Hard to say. Even now, the Northland Bank wouldn't be able to hold the Millilith off for long. But the Adepti can clear you of any wrongdoing. Oh, wow. Leo was founded by the Geo Archon and the Adepti. Of course, it was built by force. Look for them, and be faster than the Chi-Sing's messengers, so you may give your version of events first. If there is anyone that can help you and Leo and now, it can only be the mighty and illuminated Adepti. That's awesome, thank you. And then we have... In an impromptu change of plan, mean the Adepti and Jay and Curse. Um, yeah, I love that. I freaking love that. Like, again, that's just adding layers... Uh, to a game that, like, you know, again, like, a quest that probably, you know, in any, in most games wouldn't really have the same type of layers. Um, because this isn't just a situation of, like, you know, a character who shows up who's kind of mean, who, like, you know, how do, how do you say, you know, the character that shows up who's kind of mean, who's like, ha, huh, like, you're an idiot, and it calls you an idiot through the entire game. This is someone who we, like who in their order, the Fatui order, has literally at times tried to kill us, or at least like tried to like, no, tried to kill us, let's be honest. Let's be honest. Um. And I think the idea of like us distrusting them is per perfectly fine, but also the way they're writing this is kind of like a, um, kind of like an Avatar The Last Airbender situation where it's like, we may not trust this person. We may not want to trust this person. We may not ever trust this person fully, or may take a while to trust this person. But we are in a situation now where we cannot walk freely around Liyue, and we are main suspects now in a murder of a god. Um, I will take any help I can get. And that's such a good way of, like, forcing us into, like, like, companionship with a Fatui member. Or friendship, I suppose, even if you could say with a Fatui member. Um... Oh man, we're gonna unlock some more areas. That's awesome. So this is how we're gonna unlock this area here. Um, we still have this area to explore, which I'm actually very excited about. So I guess we'll start from the pool here, I guess, or the Wangshu Wangshu would actually probably be a better idea because then we can walk along. No, we can walk along the path here. Yeah, I think taking the main road is always a good idea sometimes. Uh, and then we could go to do these things as well. I notice when I'm editing a lot, I make a lot of weird noises sometimes, and I just want to say. This is my bid for running for president. I feel like that if 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 the American people see me making weird oh, noises every once in a while, they will be like, make him the president right now. Um, you know, make him, make him, make him the president. Why? Sure, he hasn't done much. Midnight Phantasmagoria. I actually really like Fischl. I really like Fischl. Many happy returns. Rain cutter. Rain outlines your face. Actually, like, really good physical damage here from Yao Yao. Right? Is, is, am I right in saying that his fire isn't as, like, like, potent as some other characters? Because, like, I love our boy to death, but, like, it seems like you have to be way more direct than you would be with, um, Bennett. You saying Bennett's cool. better? No, I'm not saying, this no, 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 you're dope. a goblin, you're the best. You're literally the best, you're the cutest, you're the most handsome boy who ever freaking lived in the whole world. You're so cute. We will, will, you know. Oh God. Ready, go! Oh, that does like, oh, yeah, that's actually perfect. Yeah. 
I, I do like this team. Um, in many elements, I think the main element, though, is design. Obviously, <laughs> I love the design of these characters, but they're actually fun to use as well, which is nice. So we might as well, yeah, we'll go up here. We haven't actually been to this area yet. Someone said that, like, the way I play right now, I probably won't get to, like, half the game that's been released already in, like, whatever, in, um, the a lot, like, how do I say, like, in the, like, in, like, in the space of, like, like, a, a three months. They think that the three months from now I'll still be, like, tearing through the game only not even halfway through and I totally agree I love the idea of what we've done here though with this the channel um, the original idea what oh hello the original idea for the for the for the channel when we started the patreon for example was uh, you know if you if you if anyone actually remembers it, um, we were like okay we'll do seven videos a week at minimum an hour with the after show uh, the community video once a month and the Roma react every week that was like the idea we're like oh that's that's that that's how we'll, we'll do this you know we'll make sure we have like this like big you know big big you know make sure we're doing longer videos than ever before and all this stuff and have fun doing it that was the idea then like I played Genshin for the first time and I was like ah this is like super fun and I'm having a really good blast playing this. And I was like, let's add three extra videos every single week to that list of, like, the gig. You know what I mean? The, the, to, to the list. No rest and for the wicked. Wings of darkness. I'm very happy I did. I'm very happy I did, is all I'll say. The only thing, obviously, that's, like, not as good as... And, like, that's, like... That like goes without saying. Um, let's get rid of this guy too. The only thing is obviously not as good, and it goes without saying. Um, but we'll say it anyway because we're 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 derivative. Obviously, no rest for the wicked. Obviously, like I'm not. So I know that like it's not like. That Yao Yao doesn't have the same cool power that Nahida had to like make the dendro stick for like seven years, and like that's obviously like such an OP thing, right? Um, but I still appreciate like Yao Yao's like physical strength and like her 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 ability to like kind of like do something like this and then do this like right after. You know what I mean? Like that's to me is sick. Like this type of spear move is sick. I love spears in games. I love spears in games. In fact, my Elden Ring playthrough right now, I'm doing a second Elden Ring playthrough at some point. I can't do it right now because obviously I don't have the time. But um, when we eventually do, I started it just before FF7 Remake came out. And I was like, okay, what we're going to do is we're going to do a spear. Because I have another playthrough. I, I already did a playthrough last year to account for the DLC coming out. And... Uh, that's going to continue on at some point uh, when we get the DLC. Not sure if we'll do the DLC on the channel. Um, I wouldn't mind. Uh, it just depends, obviously, like on timing and stuff like that. Uh, I've kind of given up on the idea of ever stopping playthroughs because new games comes out co come out. Like obviously, there's exceptions. Like I would like Tears of the Kingdom was a big deal for my channel because Zelda started my channel. Um, but. I kind of don't like the idea of just like, okay, we're going to stop an entire playthrough because a new game's coming out. Because then, like, I feel like it's... First of all, like, the idea of new games, like, ne isn't like this thing where it's like, oh, like, it's going to get so many new people in here. It's going to get so many people watching this stuff. The reality is, like, it's much more fun to, like, wait around a bit. You know? To, for me, it's much more fun to wait a bit. Uh, let everyone get a chance to play it. Um, and you have to have, like, fun on YouTube, man. If you're always thinking about, like, I gotta play this new game because of this. Oh my god, like, th 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 this new game is coming out and, like, we have to play it. 
You know, we have to play day one. It's like, why? That game is still gonna be around. You know, in 10 months. Like, I was like, oh, we should play Raincoat on release. But now I was like, oh, we're already playing something else right now. So let's wait a bit. One of the times where I'm actually like super okay with um with with that guy resetting over there. <laughs> you do you, buddy. You do you. I'll go. Oh, we have a bow user now. You ready? Oh, that's not bow, but hey, whatever. You hadn't even actually hit them. Whoa. There we go. All we need to do is knock them down. These guys are electric, so it's not the best idea to like. No, my sword. Oh my god, he's so sick. Body he's so mind. sick, guys. Time to act. Yeah. And by the way, do not do not listen to that as advice. By the way, <laughs> do not do not listen to don't play new games as advice because like different things work for different people. I just chose to like. Like, for me, the channel has done its best when I choose to, like, have the most fun possible. Like, that's it. It's a myth. It's always been a myth that, like, that I've always heard those 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 myths where it's like, uh, you can't please your audience and yourself. It's like, no, man, you can. Like, play, play that weird game you want to play. There's a smaller channel that I'm looking at now. Again, like I said, I, ha like, I haven't been able to get in contact with them to be like, hey... Do you want me to share your channel? And it's not because it's like, oh, they wouldn't want me to, but like, I, I, I feel weird doing that at any point because like, you know, especially nowadays, some people might just be doing this for themselves. They might not want to have a bigger channel, so I, I have to wait to get in contact with them. And I'm like, this person like, is just having the time of their lives doing their stuff. Look at, look at the physical damages, man. What the hell? <laughs> I love Yo Yo. Yeah. But yeah, do not take it as advice because so many YouTubers will say you have to kind of play the newer games sometimes. Especially day one. Look at me, I played Genshin Impact day one. Oh, <laughs> that's so good. That's a nice chest as well. Nice chest. Here you go. I packed it all into a bag for you. Thank you, sweetheart. What a sweetheart. Look at this area, too. Yeah. I should put a disclaimer on my videos being like, do not take anything Calvin says as proper advice. <laughs> uh, the only thing I'd always say, like, and, and, and people seem to agree, and I, I do, uh, and I will always say it to the ends of the earth, uh, and I, I will continue to say it, always have good audio, that's it. Like, I think my microphone's good. I think it sounds good. I like how it sounds. Sometimes I can I can peek it just because I'm just a loud person though, not because it's a bad microphone. Okay, let's take a look at this area over here. Oh my god, look at that. Look at how pretty that is. Come on, look where we are now. Oh, little puzzle over here. Which means we're probably gonna have to change the party setup. I love this party by the way. I love using this party. It's so good. Um baby gangsters. Deploy. Hello, boys. Have you eaten my action? Yeah, he does good physical damage in two, in fairness. But so does Bennett. Like, they all do good physical damage. But these are also level 30 boys, so, like, obviously you're gonna do a little bit better physical damage. You're not gonna do physical damage on every single enemy. Sometimes it's just fun to use your physical sword, man. Sometimes it's just fun that way. Sometimes it's just fun using physical act, uh, physical, physical weapons. Quick! What did this do? What did this do? Oh, I'll activate the chest. Okay, <laughs> I was like, huh? Is this an answer from this world? <laughs> cool. 
Let's change back a party. We're trying to get better with that other party setup uh, with um, the fashionistas. And like, I understand it's kind of redundant because this is like similar to other other parties like setup, but like I, I also just like using characters just for the sake of being characters, you know? I like them as people. Oh, that bird shadow. I can't believe a god died in this episode. <laughs> a god is dead in this episode. Look at that. Really? Should we add something to him that reduces his cooldown, maybe? Because that's a that's a high cooldown, isn't it? But is it powerful, I wonder? That's isn't it? I feel like that's a really high cooldown. Maybe we could do that right now, actually. Let's see. We probably already have it on him. Where's the artifacts? Okay, uh... Let's see. Is there one that, like, energy recharge plus 3.5%? Yeah, something like that. Uh... Do you have, like, any energy... This, this does energy recharge, right? Am I right in saying that? Just because, like, it's, like... Like I think I think it's a it's a really long cooldown, right? There's energy recharge, right? No, she it's Does Sayu need the energy recharge? I don't think so. But I don't want to take it off or wait. Oh you have that. Oh we already have one on that's energy recharge. Okay, it's just a long energy recharge. <laughs> it's just, I guess it just makes sense. I saw a Seelie around here somewhere. There it is. And he's going to take us up here. There's so many pretty places just hidden away in, in, in smaller areas. But it's just a really well thought out world too. Because not everything is just like... You know, put together. You can't obviously you can't just it. Some 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 worlds are like that. Like I played. I'm not gonna name games because like I don't want to be super negative about it because like I feel like I've already been negative about. Um, Good things come to those you know, who wait. Video games like this episode talking about like other video games not getting side characters right. So I don't want to be double negative on a game. But some games don't. You know, get the whole idea of like uh, building a world right. Yeah, but we're not gonna dwell in it because we're already a bit of, we're already, we don't want to be a negative Nancy for the whole video, you know, that would make any sense. What's in here? There's something so nice about, like, the pure reward of this being... Look at this, watch, look at the colors here as soon as you burst out. You see the sunlight? <gasps> look at that. I don't deserve this game. I don't deserve this game. What are these pillars here? Oh, they're wood. Okay. Which means they were man made. Let's do a little ley line. Start with, uh. It's always, I think it's always good to start with a little bit of dendro. You know what I mean? Oh, Jesus Christ, guys. Calm down. Fish will get him. Look at that. My yang, yeah. I think I get rid of these shamans as well. Like right away. That's the rule. We follow the rules. By royal decree. No, my soul. We follow the rules that we made ourselves. I mean, if we find a ley line, it's just smart to go and get a ley line, right? It's just one of those things. Look at this as well. Oh my god, look at that underwater. It's like an underwater, like, freaking thing. That's... 
Do you guys know about there's like a fear of like man-made objects underwater? I don't know what it's called. Is it Tesla phobia or is there something else? Um, I totally don't have that fear, but I talked about Shadow of the Colossus a few episodes back. Shadow of the Colossus is, to me, the greatest game ever made, right? It is the greatest game ever created. Uh, we should probably get this one as well. There is no better game in the world than Shadow of the Colossus, in my opinion. Um, to me, it's a perfect game. It's a game that I've played so many times. It's a game that I know back to front. Um, it's probably the, one of the few games I never, like, a few open world kind of games that I would never need a map. And I don't even consider it open world because it's kind of just like an open area. Like, it's really hard to consider an open world when it's just like, it's, it's not as big as an open world. You know what I mean? It's definitely not. But it's still open. You know what I mean? Where do you um, want this stuff delivered to, boss? What I would say is, like, always is that, like, they have these things in that game that are, like, these underwater, like, monsters that absolutely have shook me to my core when I think about them. But, like, yeah, I, I totally, when I think about it, it's like, yeah, it is, it is absolutely terrifying having man-made objects underwater. And I wonder if it's just, like, the implications of what's happened underwater then you know what i mean it's like what has happened underwater i know it's it's a big cooldown by the way because you get to keep it right yeah that makes sense Oz, reveal thyself. look at that look at that no rest. jesus christ As you wish, me, Stop it now! Stop it now! <laughs> Common is me. Stop right now to the enemy you're fighting. Cease this. I think I probably have said that a million times to the enemies in this game. Yeah, we have physical time. Um, but like, if I can like, I, it's hard for me to describe why that feeling of like, it almost feels like ill. You get like a chill up and down your spine. Again, like I said, it this feeling of like, you're not supposed to be here. Like this is a civilization that has passed you by. It's none of your business kind of deal. Get out of here. Um, and whenever I see man-made objects underwater, it feels that way. You know what I mean? It's like, holy crap, I sh I'm not supposed to be here. Like underwater, like man-made objects underwater. I, this is not my time. This is all, and maybe, the, again, it probably is the implication that, like, a civilization has been lost, or a civilization's been destroyed. Like, I totally get that, it's probably the, that, those implications. Uh, that's probably all it is as well. What is this? Bah. Hmm. This is another really cool area, though, isn't it? Look at this, what are these little things here, though? Who knows? I'm trying to see, maybe we climb on top of this might be why you have to get into it, but then again, it's like, there's a blockage on top, so I think there's gonna be a conceded effort to not. Let's check through here to see if there is no up on top here, though. There is, yeah, we have to go through the top, okay. So what's the best way to climb up from the mountain, maybe? Yep, yeah, 100%. So maybe we have to fight this guy along the way. What's that over there? Storks down there? Those storky dudes. Are you gonna come alive? You yes. You're up. <laughs> Get Dendrode. Okay, he's not getting Dendrode, guys. Oh, he did. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I understand why there's a big cooldown now, by the way. By royal decree. <laughs> Actually, doing some good damage with this party, guys. Wait, we should like I can't believe we didn't read the talents of like our characters. We should probably do that at some point too. Because like I feel like I'm just pressing triangle and it's not actually like, you know I I, I know what this move does. I know what like some of the like, you know, I could tell you what the, the other moves do at this point, right? Like I can tell you what Goblin's move does, I can tell you what Yao Yao does at this stage. Like that that you know, the dendro move, the healing move, the burst move. I can tell you what all that does. But I feel like we need to look at um Sh Sh how do you pronounce his name? Ying Xiao? I can never pronounce his name. 
You come down to me, or I, am I come back up to you? Dude, okay, if you reset your health by the time we get up there, we're gonna have problems. I'm coming up. Wait there. Wait. Oh, I thought he was coming alive too. I was like, man, this is gonna be- Oh, he is coming alive too! Okay, great. I'll come down to you now in a second as well. I'm back. Cha-cha! Oh my god! Heat seeking! Midnight Phantasmagoria. Oh, we dropped down again. I'll fight you now too. I'll fight you now too. Once. Oh my God! You come. I'll fight the bully at the same time. What's look what's about to happen? Yao Yao supremacy. Yao Yao supremacy. Okay, now, what were you saying? So I know this is also like is a healing move, which is kind of cool. Yeah, so we have a healer on our team. No, we should probably use Fischl next. Do a little, uh... Overload fusion here. Oh my god, get away from me! Stop that! Seize this right now, Goblin, tell him to stop. Stop that! Good. Poor fish is always getting, like, just, like, destroyed here. Yeah, I understand the long, um... The long cooldowns. Yeah. We'll read what his, um, his, uh, his other talents do. I think we'll do that, like, as soon as possible. This here, like, is pretty self-explanatory, right? Where where am I? Where am I? Where am I? Get out of the corner! <laughs> no! <laughs> oh, we're climbing. <laughs> oh, okay, that saved us. Climbing saved us. Fischl, you are so smart. Fischl, you are officially so, so smart. She's a genius. People can say what they want, but she's so smart. She's so smart, guys. Now we have to wait. I'll stab you for beauty, your little burst move. It is just fine for all of us. No, it's not fun. Take this. Dendro time. Yowie yeah, supremacy. Rain outlines your fate. Body and mind. There you go. Take a picture just in case. I forget. Yowie yeah, yeah, supremacy time. Official, you heard this. Well done, official. What do you think of that, guys? What do you think of that, official? Pretty good, huh? Pretty good. Okay, let's climb up to the top there to get that chest. Okay, actually, let's read. Um, is, did we, we did. We did. We did go with the right one. Okay, let's read. Uh, Let's see. I want to make sure we like have. First of all, let's go to his talents. The particular talent I want to read is this one, right? This is a special move. So, okay. So, Rainbow Blade Work. Your active character's normal attack will trigger consecutive sword rain attacks, dealing hydro damage. Okay, rain souls are made a maximum number throughout the ability's duration. Okay, that's good. So it's it's it's, it's more water damage. That move there. That's good to know. There we go. Okay, that's 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 fine. That's fine. And actually will work really well with um the dendro characters we have and Fischl as well. And will work well with Garmin too. Body and mind. Honestly, this team is fine. This team is fine. I think we're good. I think we're doing fine, guys. Um <gasps> Here we go. Oh, nice little flower. Uh, I also want to say uh, that I get messages quite a bit. I messages I mean comments. I get comments quite a bit of people being like, "Oh, we're so close. We were so close." That was very. That was a very weird way of just dropping us back down to the thing. I get messages all the time of people being like, um, 
Calvin, like, I have, I, I'm sick today, or I feel sad today, or I'm, I'm having a terrible day at work, and these videos really, really perk me up. I wait for, oh, people, when people are like, man, I, I, I wait for the Thursday vid every week. I'm like, holy hell, man. Like, you wait for these videos every week? Thank you so much. And, like, um, because, again, I always talk about, like, what are these? What are these type of flowers here? What are these flowers, guys? What are these called? What are these flowers? Hold on a second. Violet grass. So it's not, is that the one we needed for the leveling up of uh, Xinyan? Yeah, we need to go down there and check out that area there as well. Um, Because uh, I want to talk about like why it's freaking terrifying to me as well. Um, But yeah. um, Like, I remember like... Like, rushing home sometimes from college. So I could like watch some Markiplier. You know what I mean? Geo Sigil, nice. Or so I could watch like Fun House. Man, just like Alice said, like you can see in the distance, there it is. Wang Shuin. Um Easy Allies is probably like the most important thing to me. Where I remember with Easy Allies. No? There's more enemies around here? Is there another centurion beast? Um, but I remember I would like rush home, like I would rush like to watch Easy Allies. I remember I'd watch an unhealthy amount of Easy Allies. Like, to the point that it became healthy because it was good for the soul. Time to act. Um... But what's sad is like, you know, Easy Allies, you know, it's, it's not the same as it used to be. It's really not. Um, I never talk about it on, on Twitter. Um, or online. Okay. Good things come to those okay. who wait. I never talk about it online. Um, at all because I'm followed by some of the Easy Allies people. And I feel like it would be so... Oh, we need to collect these, do we? To, to activate it, maybe? Oh! oh I, maybe we have to activate... Maybe... Oh, I get it now! Okay, follow me. I think this activates the little torches, maybe. Wait. I think it activated the torches. Well, now, don't I feel so. Let's go... Oh, there, that's where all these drops went. I was like, where's this guy's drops? Um... Yeah, like, and, and I feel like, oh, they, they respawn. I feel like it's just very, very disrespectful of me to be, like, to be on, like, to be followed by the Easy Allies people, yeah. like, some of the Easy Allies people still, and have me be like, man, it's not the same as it used to be. It's like, okay, they don't need to freaking hear that. <laughs> like, that's the last thing they, they need to hear. I think that, you know, when it comes to, like, negative opinions on stuff, I think somewhere along the line with the internet, we, like, allowed ourselves to think that like negative a negative opinion is a constructive criticism when it's not always a constructive criticism saying something sucks or something like that like like legit and i'm just gonna say legit is not a constructive criticism by the way like i like i've seen that before where people will be like man this this uh this video was absolute garbage <laughs> And then if I go back, if I reply back and go, hey, shut your mouth, they go, just constructive criticism, man. But on a, like, and I think that happens like with every single like creator online, whether it be music or anything like that. Like you, like it, it's a genuine thing where like, I think somewhere along the line, we lost the idea of like the, what is constructive criticism, you know? Um. Because I think people will always hide behind a veil of constructive criticism as well. Because it's so easy for me to be like, Oh yeah, like, this, this... Oh man, this TV show is absolute garbage. We need to be faster than that. And then like... And then someone goes like, Man, like... I liked it. It's like, well, man, I'm just giving some constructive criticism. <laughs> Construction is like a thing where you build stuff. You can't build stuff by being a meanie, stupid, poopy head. Just saying. Just saying. There's a, there's probably that's probably an Aaron Hansen quote right there, isn't it? Oh. But also over the years, I've learned to like laugh along 
with uh, my audience. Okay. Um, Good things come because like the thing wait. is like I think one of the best things you could learn to do is like you know people will, people will be like oh my god Calvin got knocked out oh look at that out there so pretty look at that with the big oh we're going up there too we're going up there too you know and you have to you have to learn to like you know be able to like laugh along because some things are funny <laughs> some things are funny like recently in, in like in like you know. You know, in Pokemon, when your whole team gets destroyed by something very simple. It's funny, right? It's funny. It's not a big deal. It's funny. And by, uh, yeah, and like... So far, like... So far, I really think that, like, at least you guys, you know, can, can talk about this more than anything, because you guys are actually been in the Genshin community for way longer. I feel like I'm still, like, you know, just kind of, like, not, like, on the outside, but, like, I feel like there is still, like, a part of me that's, like, you know, I, I don't, I don't, I don't always interact with the Genshin. I started only recently posting, like, Genshin posts, like, where I'm, like, posting pictures of Genshin characters being, like, oh my god, look at this guy, um, which is fun. Um, but I've been so welcomed into the Genshin community, man. Like... Like this, this community cool. that I was told, I was told, I cut off the dope, that like I was gonna be eaten alive. I was told that I was gonna be like murdered. But like really, it's like the majority of the Genshin fans just not? want people to play their game. There's no like I have not come across gatekeeper, gatekeepers at all. Even the people that are like, you know, meta, meta people that are already into the meta, what they call meta slaves, are really awesome. I love this little like. Doorway here. Walk through the doorway. Go on. Like, as soon as you explain to them, hey, I don't want to do the mana, they're kind of like, okay. <laughs> you know? So this lets you do even more water moves, which I'm actually like, like this is this turns into a water attack. Sick. Like actually a sick character, right? At least I feel welcome. You know what I mean? I, like, I know other people have like probably worse experiences than I, I do when it comes to like. Is that not supposed to heal us? Am I wrong? You wish, main Fräulein. I love this song. It's probably one of my favorite songs in the game. <laughs> That's such a good picture. <laughs> ah! <laughs> <laughs> ah! Oh no, he's smiling. It's fine. <laughs> That's awesome. And now we have you guys as well. Honestly? Oh, you come down? We should, uh, this is why we have a character like Fish on our team. You know what I mean? This is why we have her. No, my sword. Ring cutter. Excellent. How close is that lead line? It's not close at all. <laughs> I was like, geez, that Leyline seems pretty close. Body and mind. Body and mind. There's more chests down there. Man, there's a lot of valleys in this area, but I wanted to go over here. There's also a waypoint in the sky I saw at one point. So let's climb up to the top so we can get a good look, a good look at this area, Batman style. I, I like, yeah. I'll just say I personally feel welcome in the community. So far, anyway. Wait till you get a load of my opinions on, on, world three, on, 
I'm waiting to see uh, what I say. He's got to say some crazy stuff. That's a really cool animation, isn't it? Okay, so it was over... Where was the area I wanted to look at here? I think it was over this direction, wasn't it? In this water over here. I want to see... I want to kind of look down here in this. There's also like a waypoint in the sky over here, which means we're going to have to climb the mountains if we want that waypoint. Totally up for that at some point. Um... Yeah, this is what I wanted to look at. Look at this here. Like, actually... Wait, can you, maybe you can drain the water. There's probably a possibility that you can drain the water. Oh my god, we have to cross this bridge as well. I love crossing the bridge. And this bridge over here too. We gotta cross some bridges, guys. Hope you're ready. Hope you're ready to cross some bridges, guys. I am. So this is where we started. So let's go back here. Yeah, this is where we came from. What's that song? Um. What's that song that I'm thinking? It's like... Something about forgetting where you are to know where you're going. Oh my god, that's gonna annoy me all day. I know it's it's like because like I can hear him, I can I can like hear it in my head, but I don't know the lyrics. There's one for you right there. Well, we're gonna have to be fast with this. I wonder who would be the, a better idea for this then. Is it only two? It can't be only two. Can't be only two. Maybe it is only two. Hello, boys. It's me. Ka you, Glenn, you're out. <laughs> it's also Yao Yao. I forgot to tell you guys. I know I, f I feel terrible because you guys thought it was only me. But Yao Yao's here too. I know I feel terrible. I lied. A little vaporizing. You know, a little, little vaporizing going on here. Yeah, I love this party. Wow, these will last us for days. They probably will. Okay, so is it if it's only the two of them? I'll do it, Monty. We're fine. No, there's three of them. Okay, I see them now. Uh, what's the best course of action for this? I wonder. To have a... To... to... Whew. Okay, I have an idea. Okay, let's switch to... Baby Gangsters for a second. I have an idea. Sayo's like, now you need me. Yes, Sayo, you are perfect, okay? I want you to know. So we set fire to the ground. Uh, do a Sayo on this. This is my plan. Can't catch me. That was my plan. I I was so sure that was gonna work. I was like, this is the plan. It worked. Nice. Nice. Party setup. Again, we're still practicing with this new party. The fashionistas. Really good. That was really fun being able to like figure that out. There we go. Oh, a little picture opportunity. Actually very pretty. This game is really gorgeous at nighttime. Like really gorgeous. Um it has the advantage of being gorgeous though in the daytime and the nighttime. Uh and I like that quite a bit. Maybe we can go back and actually like do the how many how many oh, ha, 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 ha. 
Ah, ah, you will all die. Is there any indicator of how long this will last for the the the, the oh, maybe a break? Oh, there it is. I can kind of, I think I can kind of see it. Oh my god, look at these boys. Old us would have just used Nahida, right? Looks like I'm using Nahida a lot. Hello! Have a little fun with that. Get rid of the shaman. Get rid of that, that shaman needs to get getting 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 going. Oh, I felt that in my legs. I felt that in my legs. More opponents incoming? By royal decree. Wings of darkness. Come, sever night from day. Oh wait, hold on a second. Gomin, you ready? Oh wow, look at these boys. I don't know why the R2 button isn't working for me. Can you can you can you just use your R2 button, please? It's very strange. Like, uh, and it, and then this guy's freaking. Oh, great! Thanks for juggling me for three hours. That makes me feel so good. So I think you need to keep her out in the field. I don't think it's a thing where you can just heal and then run. Stop. Stop. Get some help. Okay, now, now we can talk. Now we can talk. Where are you? Now we can talk. Just wondering. I heard you talking a lot of crap about me. Switch characters right now. If you're gonna drop down, drop down. You ain't reset. It's so nice to have a physical character again. Pack everything up nice and carefully. Don't if there is cuts again, like I said. We're still- oh, it's a, it's a little trial? Oh no, it's- it sucks in the water! Okay, so we actually can go down here. I don't know, I kind of felt like it was kind of cool having this little, um, area here that was not... Um... That was not accessible, but I guess, like, it is accessible. And it's like a little trial door as well, so maybe we have to, like, activate this again. So really we have to, like... Do this thing we did before, but again. Oh, just stop climbing the tree, Gaman. Okay, that's the, one of them. That's two of them. 
And there's one over here as well. So what's the best course of action for this one? Is just to, to, to get this one again and move over? I think it is. I think it's the way for this to respawn. Oh, it's underwater. Okay, cool. Uh, at least that's my perspective. Or we could use Sayu and roll over here. Or we could just... They usually respawn. I guess they're not responding now because we probably have others on the map. So they're like, hey, you don't need it. Stop trying to get stuff you don't need. Like this, maybe? Okay. We did it? Nice. Um, I think we can- I think we're able to heal like this though, right? Yeah. Look at that. Yeah. It's not a fantastic heal, but it's a heal. So we got a chest, we got a new dungeon, we got another geo thing that we can collect. I kind of feel strange doing this though, right? It's like, but I guess it is like, it seems like it's made to be this way. You know, it's made to protect something, so I guess that makes sense. Where do you want this stuff delivered to, boss? You're off duty today. You're off duty today, Garmin. You're, you're our boy today. You're off duty. Okay, that was actually like a really nice little detour, wasn't it? I wonder what level the dungeon is, by the way. Oh, we don't need to do that. Yeah, like it's so weird now. This went from being like one of the scariest places I could be. To actually being kind of peaceful. Insanely pretty game. There's also somewhere there we can get to, but like, look at that. Like, the way the waterfall comes down there, too. Not natural. So, okay. Hold on a second. Level 38. Yeah, let's try one. We haven't done this in a long. Oh, we also have to go back and give that st th those flowers so we can finish off our weekly stuff. Your character will be periodically conflicted with smoldering flames, causing you to take pyro damage until... Okay, cool. Let's do this. So it's a little challenge. You think I'm afraid of pyro... By smoldering flames? Oh, gosh! <laughs> I'm kind of afraid. Um, I'm gonna feed fish some stuff. So she can come out and do this. Oh yeah, a little bit dendro as well, you know? A little bit dendro. Rain outlines your face. I know why I did that for you know honest with you. Five minutes though. Let me leave you a verse. Very clear. I still need like a, a boatload of practice with this uh, with this party, for sure. Like for sure, even switching back and forth isn't as natural. Yeah. 
You know what I mean? I, I, I feel, still feel there's like, like a boatload of practice that we need to do if we want to have a party like this. It is, it is, it is, it is, like, I think, I think it is just like a, a higher level we're going to need more practice, for sure. I ain't proud, I, I, I'm so, so proud to say that we don't need a bit more practice. As you wish, main Fräulein. immune to lightning is that what I'm is that what we're getting in here like I gen I'm, I'm, it's a genuine question like are they immune to light because every time I send lightning out and they're not overloading like if I do this no they are overloading okay okay We should have we should have focused on this guy. This is this this was silliest but on my part. Yeah, it's kind of silliness I think in this battle, guys. For me, kind of a bit of silliness. actually very proud of the areas he was he kind of grew up in right which is kind of cool i wasn't i wasn't proud of that i wasn't proud of that at all i feel like um when push came to shove like we didn't switch as well we didn't work as well um yeah yeah so what can you do look look you can only just try to get better next time that's all you can try to do. We'll leave the domain. Thank you so much for the prizes, though. And it's literally just up there we have to go. That's great. Um, how much how much gems do we have by now? With it, by the way, we have we have enough for a wish. I don't know if we should because we did we got a five star on one wish. We have enough for six wishes. Man, you know what? Let's just do it. Let's just do it. Why not? You know what I mean? Like, let's just give let's just give you guys. We we need we need we need to pick me up after that performance. Four star at least. It's a four star weapon or a four four star character. Okay. <laughs> it's okay. Uh Okay. 
go. Two more wishes we have. Oh, it's another four star. Four star character. Or four star weapon. Probably four star weapon at this point. Yeah. Oh my god, we could do. Oh, that's actually good. Yeah, great. Yeah. Let's go. Why not? Why not? Why not? You know what? I have an idea. Let's buy one more wish with this with this with this stuff, okay? Now I know what you're gonna say, Calvin. Let's buy two wishes. No, that's not what you starts to change. Let's buy Oh no, no, we can't buy this. That's different. <laughs> okay. Wait, we can. Let's buy two wishes, okay? Hear me out, okay? Hear me out. Let's just let's just try two more times. Oh look at her! Just dancing away. Hear me out. Okay. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. We're not gonna feel bad if we don't get the, the thing we want, okay? If we don't get Yao. Yeah, we're not gonna get Yao today. One more wish, and it's the last one. One more wish. One more wish. One, one more wish, what do you think? Oh, people are gonna be like, Calvin, don't use those. No, one more wish. Okay. This is gonna be just a basic weapon, of course. Yeah. <laughs> it's okay, it's okay. We uh, we played the game and we, we got busted for it. Hopefully we'll we'll find time to get Zhao in the, in the coming days. Um, hopefully. Uh, yeah. Uh, Guys, we're about to go into New Game Plus, because uh, I do want to read something before we go, because I do like reading in this game too, and like learning about stuff, I guess. Um, uh, <laughs> but yeah, we have a new Pilly Bird Ballad? No, we don't. We, we all read this one already. We read this one too. Oh, the Stone Beasts. Oh, actually, do, I think it'd be nice to read these ones. So, the records of Jeum. The Stone Beasts. Stone statues appear all across the vast land of Liyue. Most were built by locals who prayed to them for favorable weather and peace steadfast as the mountains, but it's claimed that some have a much more ancient history. One story regarding the animal statues in particular is popular among the fishermen of uh, Bishu River. The silvergrass harvest of the Dishu March and the old mining crowd, they say that in some corners of land the ancient stumbies were wake- No, we read this. We read this. We read this. I remember reading this, right? Because you read about the stone beast that like- Yeah, I think we read about the stone beast. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I remember reading about this now. Uh, okay, let's see. It's hard to find out what we ha haven't read in full. Tales from the Waves. We definitely haven't read this. Right? Rising Tide. As the moon hung bright among the sea's stars uh, above, hums of a sea science shanty slowly began to rise over the waters below. There was once a mighty ship that would lay anchor in Liyue Harbor. Its captain was a man who tracked and, ha and hunted terrible monsters of the deep known as Skipper. The ship's hull was adorned with skeletons of monsters from the sea, an unmistakable signal of their skipper's fearless will. However, the shanties of the crew seldom made any mention of hunting creatures of the deep. It's not that the sailors didn't have a revel in their reputation and brag of their achievements, but of naviga navigating the merciless seas that had taught them the ballads of blood and water were most of uh, unlucky of all. With the sword in hand, the skipper sailed across the watery expanse, coasting along the rocky reefs and cruising with surging undercurrents. He fearlessly guided his ship to face the roar of the squalls and sea monsters alike. The dark worlds that lay beneath the murky waters were like boundless hunting grounds. Any monsters that would dare stare, stir the tranquil waters often became the next trophy hanging from the side of the ship. But the skipper only knew wind and waves and never seemed to grasp the bittersweet lives of ordinary people. For he occupied all of his days with searching and hunting, and accompanied solely by the salty sea breeze and the muffled calls of uh, the whales in the deep. The crew feared him more than they adored him. Ever cautious of his character, relentless as if trying to break free from the tangles of seaweed, the skipper's clippers silently sailed towards unyielding to the perilous stretches of the sea. Only the young maiden who always sat atop the tower uh, bow could ever reveal a glimmer of softness in the skipper's eyes. She was his navigator, charmed by the tidal song and humming with the whales, guiding the ship through the wind and waves and waters infested by the beasts. A young maiden at the helm offered her song to the sea, paying due respects to its every billow and breeze. 
Hark the call of the creatures of the deep, and echo to the waves tossed in the gale. When the sea and the winds flow in our favour towards the horizon, we shall we sail. May the de deities that have passed, uh, and me old captain too, steer our bow through the boundless sea, and point our compass true. May we guide every sailor's soul to the port they call home. The chorus of Shanty gave way to the bellowing uh, orders of the skipper, promptly calling all hands to set sail. The mighty vessel slowly left the port and came underway, sinking into the horizon under the first glimmer of the dawn. This is how the story of every voyage would begin, just as uh, they had each day before. So there's a skipper who his people are afraid of, and this skipper... Pretty much like has abandoned all humanity apart from the sea, which is interesting, I don't know. Um, I like reading these stories, I like reading them out, and I hope you guys enjoy me reading them. Guys, thank you so much for watching this episode, thank you so much for watching this series. Actually, before we go, we should probably... Hold on a second. Uh, do we have enough for that guy's mission? For Connor's brew? How much does he need? I think we have just enough. We have just enough to give him, give him his stuff. Yeah, we should give him this stuff before we do anything else. Uh, we can warp to there next time if we need to. Where is the Dawn Winery? We've never been here before, so it's a bit awkward. Uh, that's a joke, by the way, because we most definitely have been in the Dawn Winery about three million times. Wait, where does... What? Did I mark this thing on the map? Did I not mark this quest? Like, the Dawn Winery is here, right? Yeah. Has he gone? Is he no longer alive? Okay, now it's marked. Okay. <laughs> I was like, what the hell? Man, there's a feeling of safety in Mondstadt, right? Like, I know it's not safe, but, like, there's a feeling of safety. Uh, as we're doing this, I want to say thank you to the I Can Never Repay the Baby Gangsta Tier on Patreon. That's Typhiro2, Jamie Bull, Janet the Banana, Rachel Est, the Ghost of Inazuma, Felicitous Felix, George Candelaria, Eskun, Yuld, Radish, and Poke Girl. Thank you guys so much for always being so kind. And let's go give this guy his three flowers so we can raise up our goddamn stuff and go back to the lady and be like, hey, look, we got our reputation raised. We did it. Will the Dawn Winery here for a tour? No, I got your stuff. It was not rather quick. Okay, so he's giving us the wine? Oh no, just some stuff. I guess it's just he's making the wine. Okay, so I guess we should go back then to the lady over here. Um, do we tell her about our reputation? Do we get... So we did our weekly request at the very least. Oh, we already got our awards, though. Okay, cool. We didn't do our weekly bounties, but I think we can start doing these next week. I think I think we can just get a good grip on them, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you guys for being patient with the new characters. I like this team quite a bit, but we're going to see how things go. Uh, I will see you guys Thursday for the next Genshin video. And... There's Pokemon every day, by the way, guys. If you are looking for another playthrough to watch as well, there's Pokemon every single day. We got so many other playthroughs playing as well. And I'll see you guys very soon. Bye-bye.